हेलो एवरीवन गौरी हियर टुडेज वीडियो इज अबाउट कैंसर बायोलॉजी इट्स एप्लीकेशंस स्किल्स रिक्वायर्ड टू बिकम अ कैंसर साइंटिस्ट एंड आई विल आल्सो टॉक अबाउट ग्लोबल एंड इंडियन कैंसर इंस्टीट्यूट्स लेट्स बिगिन कैंसर इज अ डिसीज इन विच सम ऑफ द बॉडी सेल्स ग्रो अनकंट्रोलेबली एंड स्प्रेड टू अदर पार्ट्स ऑफ द बॉडी कैंसर बायोलॉजी is the study of the cellular and molecular mechanisms of cancer including its development progression and treatment here are the examples of the application of cancer research first is developing new cancer therapies such as targeted therapies and immunotherapies targeted therapy is a type of cancer treatment that targets proteins that control how cancer cells grow divide and spread immunotherapy is a type of cancer treatment that helps your immune system fight cancer second is identifying and studying genetic and environmental risk factors for cancer current research suggests that environmental factors such as tobacco diet infection alcohol drugs radiation and chemicals are more important than genetic that is hereditary factors in determining development of most cancers third is developing early detection and diagnostic test for cancer early detection of cancer greatly increases the chances for successful treatment the two components of early detection of cancer are early diagnosis or downstaging and second screening fourth is understanding the mechanisms of resistance to cancer treatments understanding the molecular mechanisms that result in the development of drug resistance is an increasingly important issue which has been approached through the comprehensive genomics analysis of mdr cancer cells including the epigenetics associated with drug resistance and the identification of multi drug resistance genes fifth is investigating the role of the immune system in cancer development and progression tumor development can be controlled by cytotoxic innate and adaptive immune cells however as the tumor develops from neoplastic tissue to clinically detectable tumors cancer cells evolve different mechanisms that mimic peripheral immune tolerance in order to avoid tumoricidal attack now let us know the skills required to become a cancer scientist first is strong background in molecular biology genetics and biochemistry then knowledge of cell culture and animal models is also required apart from these strong analytical and critical thinking skills problem solving skills organizational and time management communication and collaboration writing and presentation computer skills including proficiency in data analysis software attention to detail and laboratory skills are also required now let us move ahead and have some information on global and indian cancer research institutes the top 10 global cancer research can centers and institutes are first Memorial Sloan Kettering Cancer Center it is a cancer treatment and research institution in the borough of Manhattan in New York City second is the University of Texas MD Anderson Cancer Center which is a comprehensive cancer center in Houston Texas it is the largest cancer center in the USA and one of the original three comprehensive cancer centers in the country third is Cancer Research UK which is the world's largest independent cancer research organization it is registered as a charity in the united kingdom fourth is the Ellie and Edith L Broad Institute of MIT and Harvard it is often referred to as the Broad Institute it is a medical and genomic research center which is located in Cambridge Massachusetts United States fifth is the german cancer research center which is is a national cancer research center 
based in Heidelberg, Germany. It is a member of the Helmonds Association of German Research Center, the largest scientific organization in Germany. Sixth is the Peter McCallum Cancer Center, which is also known as the Peter McCallum Cancer Institute and commonly abbreviated as Peter Mac. It is an Australian Oncology Research Institute, Cancer Treatment and Professional Oncologist Training Cancer Center, which is located in Melbourne, Victoria. Seventh is Cancer Campus, which is a research and innovative campus in oncology and it was launched in April 2006. It is devoted to help fight cancer. Eighth is the Cancer Science Institute of Singapore and it aims to position Singapore as a global leader in the field of biomedical sciences. It is dedicated to conducting a multifaceted and coordinated approach to cancer research extending from basic cancer studies all the way to experimental therapeutics and in so doing improving cancer treatment. Ninth is the University of Texas Southwestern Medical Center. It is a public academic health science center in Dallas, Texas. Tenth is Dana Faber Cancer Institute which is a comprehensive cancer treatment and research institution in Boston, USA. The top 10 Indian Cancer Research Centers and Institutes are First, the Indian Council of Medical Research, which is the apex body in India for the formulation, coordination and promotion of biomedical research, which is one of the oldest and largest medical research bodies in the world. Second is the Tata Memorial Hospital, situated in Parel, Mumbai in India. It is a specialist cancer treatment and research center closely associated with the advanced cancer for treatment research and education in cancer. Third is the All India Institutes of Medical Sciences is a group of autonomous government public medical in universities of higher education under the jurisdiction of Ministry of Health and Family Welfare, Government of India. Fourth is Indo-American Cancer Institute and Research Center Established in Hyderabad with some of the best cancer specialists in India Fifth is Christian Medical College, Velour, widely known as CMC Velour, is a private Christian community-run medical school, hospital and research institute This institute includes a network of primary, secondary and tertiary care hospitals in and around Velour. Tamil Nadu, India. Sixth is National Center for Biological Sciences in Bangalore, Karnataka, which is a research center specializing in biological research. It is a part of Tata Institute of Fundamental Research, TIFR, under the Department of Atomic Energy of the Government of India. Seventh is Indian Institute of Technology, Kanpur, IIT Kanpur is a public institute of technology located in Kanpur, Uttar Pradesh. It was declared to be an institute of national importance by the Government of India under the Institutes of Technology Act. Eighth is National Institute of Cancer Prevention and Research. It has a unique approach of amalgamating strong, basic, clinical and applied research involving medical and community practice with an emphasis on early detection, primary and secondary prevention of cancer. Ninth is the Indian Institute of Sciences, IISC, located in Bangalore, is a public deemed research university for higher education and research in science, engineering, design and management. Last is the latest research department in cancer biology, which is CDRI, Central Drug Research Institute in Lucknow. This research center has a team of highly committed scientists and research scholars from biological and chemical sciences which are having great skills and knowledge in the field of cancer biology. So that is it for today. I hope you enjoyed watching the video and found it informative and insightful. Do like, share and subscribe to our channel. Thank you.